涙の色はエメラルドブルー宝石みたいに光ってる Welcome, Magic Friends. It's Crazy Katana. Wild of All Dream pre release weekend. We have a pre release kit here to open up together. So, who else is excited? This is a crazy cool set. Love the enchanting tells.、Um, let's slide this out of the box. Where's my dice? Oh, it's in the box. Ha!、Huh. Box, dice. Oh, we got a red one. Bummer, I was looking for purple. Got a yellow and a red. We'll have to trade those. Arena code. This we got. Oh my goodness! And look at what we got in this box the Moonshaker Calvary. Oh my gosh, this is just already going to be a mythic box. Oh, it's the five and three whites flying, six, six. When Moonshaker Calvary enters the battlefield, creatures you control gain flying and get plus X plus X till end of turn, where X is the number of creatures you control. Woohoo! What a pull! Mythic. This one came with、um, this interesting artwork here as well for your box divider. Okay, well, that's cool. I mean, I guess that offsets the、uh, red dice and then your gingerbread people and how to put your decks together. Pretty cool. All right, let's get cracking. We've got six draft booster packs, and this can only be the best box ever with that mythic pull. So, all of these should have mythics in them, right? Okay. If not, triple rare, if not triple rare packs. Okay, so we have Toadstool Admirer, Scream Puff, Quick Study, Frostbridge Guard,、uh, The Bloodline, Edgewall Pack, The Dogs, Prophetic Prism, Frantic Firebolt, Return Triumphant, Belligerent of the Ball, Knight of Doves, that's such pretty artwork, Disdainful Stroke, and the rare. So, the first rare in both of the pre release packs I've had have both been red. This one is Godric Cloaked、uh, Reveler, 1 2 red, legendary creature, haste and celebration, 3 3, as long as two or more non land permanents enter the battlefield under your control this turn. Godric Cloak Revealer is a dragon with base, power, and toughness, 4 4 flying, and red. Uh, one red dragons you control get plus one plus one till end of turn. So that is our rare for this pack. And oh my gosh, I knew it was going to be a phenomenal pack. We got Bitter Blossom. Oh my. So we've got the one in the black at the beginning of your upkeep. You lose one life, but you do get to create a really cool one one black fairy creature token with flying. Oh, this is such a great pack. Then we have a forest and our food token. So lots of cool. Food artwork. I knew this had to be a super pack. All right, on to number two. We have the Root Rider Fawn, Ferocious Vermin, Ice Out, Kellen's Light Blades, Titanic Growth, Witch's Mark, Ginger Brute. All the cool food, the little gingerbread man running down the road, and there's a wolf in the background. All the cool. Forest out there in the wild, Scarecrow Guide, Chancellor of Tales, High Fae Negotiator, Callus Self or Cell Sword, l -l -l Tongue Twister, The Rare Will Be a Land, The Restless Vine Stalk.、Um, it enters the battlefield tapped. You can tap for a green or blue. Three green and blue you, until end of turn. Restless Vine Stalk becomes a 5 5 green and blue plant. Creature with trample, it's still a land. Whenever Restless Vine Stalk attacks up to one other target creature, has base power and toughness of 3 3 until end of turn. Look at this double rare pack. We have Fraying Sanity for the Enchanting Tales. It's an aura curse for two and a blue each player at the beginning of each. In step, enchanted player mills X card where X is the number of cards put into their graveyard from anywhere this turn. And the pretty foil is Knight of Sweets Revenge. The food takes over for the revenge. A nice island and the cute little mouse creature token card. All right, pack number three that also get us halfway through our pre release box opening once it is unwrapped and we see what's in it. I'm just so excited. Curse of the Werefox. Shatter the Oath. Slight of Hand. Besotted Knight. The Beanstalk Worm. That's what our art card was, was that plant worm.、Um, or the divider at the beginning of the opening. Grabby Giant. Sky Beast Tracker. Gnawing Crescendo. 
Sorrow Naughty Creature Fairy Glass Casket. All right, coming back. Archive Dragon Stone Splitter Bolt. And another rare, it is red, Rotisserie Elemental, 1-1 one, one Menace. When the Rotisserie Elemental deals combat damage to a player, put a skewer counter on Rotisserie Elemental, then you may sacrifice it. If you do exile the top X cards of your library, where X is the number of skewer counters on Rotisserie Elemental, you may play those cards this turn for one red. And we have a nice white griffy airy for our enchanting tells followed by a mountain and a rat token look at that rat going through the food all right pack number four getting us through our pre-release pack this one is sizzling and on fire with the red mythics or the red rares and the crazy mythics let's pull some more hopeless nightmare obira's attendance savior of the sleeping root rider fawn ferocious vermin Ratcheteer Trainee, Red Tooth Genealogist, Skewer Slinger, Embrith Veteran, Cheeky Mouse, Cheeky House Mouse, our cute little mouse, Knight of the Sweet's Revenge again, and the rare will be Feral Encounters, a sorcery. Look at the top five cards of your library. You may exile a creature card from among them. Put the rest on the bottom of your library in a random order. You may cast the exile card this turn. At the beginning of the next combat phase this turn, target creature you control deals combat damage equal to its power up to one target creature you don't control. It's two green, and that is a paragraph full of text. Knightly Valor for four and a white. The enchantment aura enchant creature when Knightly Valor enters the battlefield, create a 2 2 white knight creature token with vigilance. An enchanted creature gets plus two, plus two, and has vigilance. The beautiful foil will be the merfolk coil smith, and that will be a planes to follow and just on an adventure card. All right, pack number five. We need some more mythics and some more triple rare packs. So, what can we get in our last two? packs from this pre-release box. Oh, we finally got the warehouse tabby. Love the cats. All right, cat and mouse or cat and rat. Diminisher, Diminisher Witch, Break the Spell, Hamlet Glutton, Feed the Cauldron, Storm, Storm Keld Prowler, Minecraft Daredevil, Evolving Wilds, Merry Bards, Obira, Dreaming Duelist, our Fairy Warrior. This is a legendary creature where one blue and a black and can be used for your commander. Taken by Nightmares, Galvanic Giant, and the rare for this pack is a Restless of Bivouac. It is uh, Interest Battlefield tapped, and you can add a white or red one and a white and a red. Uh, the Bivouac becomes a 2-2 red and white ox creature token until end of turn. It's still a land whenever Bivouac attacks. Put a plus one, plus one counter on target creature you control. And this will have a double rare. We have the hardened scales in our enchanting tails. It is only one green. If one or more plus one, plus one counters would be put on a creature you control, that many plus one, plus one counters are put on it instead. All right. And a beautiful swamp for the land. And we have our adventure card. All right. On to the last pack. Oh, I'm so sad. Last pack for this pre-release kit that has been just out of the park awesome we have rowan's grim search to get us started johan's stop gap slumbering keep guard ferocious were fox sweet tooth witch torch the tower snare master sprite ariette's whisper unruly catapult succumb to the cold Sear our mount the redeemer back for seconds okay we have a mythic another mythic all right italian the kindly lord legendary creature fairy noble flying italian the kindly lord enters the battlefield choose a number between one and ten whenever an opponent casts a spell with mana value power or toughness equal to the chosen number that player loses two life and you draw a card it's only two blue and a black and that is amazing it is also the borderless so this is a super great mythic pull and that will be followed by the intangible virtue for one and a white a full mountain and a treasure token so so this was a bomb of a pre-release opening um, Moonshaker Calvary um, nice wrapped in that foil and stamped I can only imagine what that what value that that is going to hold additionally we got that full art um, for our mythic battalion and I believe we had one other mythic yes we did we had the bitter blossom so what a triple mythic trifecta killer pack from Wild to Eldraine I hope you all enjoy a great pre-release weekend it's crazy katana and I look forward to opening feature packs with you.